Hello guys and welcome back to Electro Horde. So this is the setup that I have today for us to explore. What we're gonna do today is get a Palm VX. This is the Palm that I have here. And we're gonna get it to print to the HP H2240B pocket printer. So you've seen this printer before on the channel. If you haven't, please check my other videos because I've made a video about it. Uh, printing with uh, HP calculators uh, last week. So today I'm gonna try to print it, to print with it using a pocket PC, okay? So first of all, we need a laptop computer to install the, the software that will, that will run here to make this thing compatible with the SIR, the serial IR interface from the, for the Hewlett Packard uh, pocket printer. And after we get it running here, we'll print something and try to get this, both of this working together, right? So let's start. So guys, if you watched my last video about this HP A2240B pocket printer, you'll know that this thing does not use standard IRDA protocol. It actually uses what's called an SIR serial IR uh, protocol. So to print with it, you actually have to use some kind of software to convert the IRDA back to SIR so it will understand and print, okay? So that's what this software is for. Thank you very much, whoever you are, and made this software uh, available for free. You can download at redeye.wiki.com. Uh, this is a software specifically made for Palm. So since we're gonna use today a Palm VX, here it is to print. So I just download this, the, downloaded this software. Uh, it works just fine with the, Palm, with the Palm VX and several other different Palm tops. And this will allow us to print uh, using the SIR, the serial IR interface with the HP A2240B printer, okay? So I'm gonna download the software, I'm gonna transfer it to a different laptop, a ThinkPad, which has serial port because my, my Palm dock uh, only has serial port. We'll get the software installed here and then we'll try to print something, okay? So here I have a, a, another ThinkPad. Uh, Palm to, the Palm, Palm VX is connected through the serial port on the back of this X31 IBM ThinkPad. And I already have download the, the software, which is this icon. So we can just double click it and it will automatically open for us to be installed on the, on the Palm handheld. There it is. Then we can just hit the hot sync button and this says that it was interrupted because I was still editing data. Okay, so now I have just closed the, the window so it should work now. Let's just hit okay here. Let's click on sync again. It's syncing. It's installing handheld applications, backing up database and that's it. Syncing has finished, the software is now installed here. So I'll just rearrange this. Uh, we don't need the laptop anymore. Now we just need the, the palm and the printer and we'll try to get something printed. Okay, so now it's time to check if the software is correctly installed and it is. Uh, if we go to home here, we can see that RedEye is one of the, the softwares here. Here it is. And to print it, all you have to do is hit print clipboard. It will print whatever you copied over to the clipboard. To the clipboard. So let's try it. Uh, first, let's turn the printer on. Okay, it's on. Now let's go to memo pad and let's just try to select all of this. Let's go to edit, copy. Okay, so we just copied it and now let's try to print it. So we open the red eye application and now all we have to do is hit the print clipboard button. Let's see if it works. Okay, so 
it just printed let's just fit the paper a little bit here let's see the results well yeah we did get a nice printing uh, it's dark it's sharp uh, it's very very easy to read as you can see that's what I copied over to the to the clipboard now we can just take the paper out here's what we got here's the end result that we got that I copied over to the to the clipboard and that's it it's very easy to print using this uh, we can try to print something else just this will be a quick video as you can see because it's basically just printing with a palm vx i don't know if you guys remember this palm top but it was pretty common back in the early late 90s and early 2000s and now let's let's try to get something different here let's open up this let's copy over everything let me select everything let me copy okay done now let's get back to red eye and let's get something different printed okay so let me just put this aside let me just get a better angle here for you guys to see the printing okay so let's just hit print clipboard and there it is let's put the palm vx aside let's see what we got here Let's just hit line fit here for a couple of times. Okay, now let's get the paper out. Okay, I just tore the paper apart. <laughs> I hope you guys can still read whatever was in here. So, well, I just destroyed the paper, but you guys can actually see that it did print. Uh, it did work. Let's do it one more time. Let's try to get this. I'm having a hard time to get this paper out, so we try once more. Let's see if now I can get it. Not perfect, but I think that should work. So let's get the palm back. Let's hit the print button once again. Print. Okay, now let's. Let's just feed a little more paper so I don't destroy it this time, okay? As you can see, it worked just fine. It's missing an eye here. The message was, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Stay cool and keep hoarding. But I probably just forgot to select it here uh, during the printing. Let's get back to memo pad. I probably did not select the eye there so it was left out let's try it once more so you guys can even see it printing one more time okay there it is it should print fine now there it is let's give it a few line feeds here so I can get this paper out without destroying it like the other time. There we go. So that's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. If you have any comments, please feel free to leave them down below. Stay cool and keep hoarding. See you next time.